how's it going? In this tutorial with Final Cut Pro, I'm going to show you how to use the three-way color corrector to make your videos just look a little bit more, uh, have a little more life to them, and more of a film look than just a standard video camera. So what you need to do first is get whatever you want to color correct in uh, your timeline. So as you can see here, I just have a clip of uh, my backyard, my neighbor's trees and stuff. Um, so next what you need to do once you have your clips in your timeline you're gonna go to your browser and go to effects and then use the little drop down arrow on video filters then color correction and then scroll down to color corrector three way so what you're gonna do from there is drag your effect on top of the video on your clip so once that's on, we're then going to go into filters, double click on this, filters, I already did uh, color correction so I have it there but I, I just uh, unchecked it uh, for the purpose of this video. So next, if it doesn't come up with three color wheels, you're just going to click on visual. And this is what it's going to give you. I'm just going to scroll over here uh, through the video and get a part that looks uh, somewhat okay to work with. So what by doing that I just kind of find the best kind uh, best kind of thing to work with, uh, the best frame I guess to see uh, what it's going to look like and then we'll just uh, scroll through it again and watch it to see if the color correcting uh, looks alright the whole way through. So um, basically you have your three color wheels here. You have your blacks right here, your mids, and your whites. Now you don't have to be, um, you don't have to be an expert on colors and how to do this. You just kind of have to adjust uh, the bars and things to make it look good, and you'll know when you achieve that look. So um, the big thing is, uh, in my opinion, is blacks. So when you see when you drag the slider, when you go up, it goes more white. When you go down, it goes black. So this is not really in the middle, but somewhat in the middle. I'm just going to bring down the blacks a little bit, like that. So now we have our blacks done. Um, next, I'm going to go to the whites. So as you can see, when you go this way, it makes the whites brighter. When you go this way, it makes the whites darker. So I'm just going to make the, the whites a little bit brighter. And then we have our mids. So our mids, um, just basically in the middle between blacks and whites. Uh, so left or to the right, it makes it whiter. To the uh, to the left, it makes it darker. So I'm just gonna bring it down just a tiny bit. Now you don't have to adjust these color wheels. You can if you want. I just use to like the sliders. Use to uh, I just like to use the sliders. But um, usually with my mids, I kind of take it to the color that is most prominent or dominant uh, in the video. So as you can see, it's leaves and trees and things, so it's green. So I'm just going to drag this uh, color wheel, this little pointer, towards the greens. So there. That's basically uh, the color corrector. So I'm just going to go back here to our filters. I'm just going to turn off this color correcting filter. Actually before I do that I'm going to show you. Um, you can uh, sh uh, preview what your clip used to look like and what your clip looks like now just by clicking this little eye here. When you uncheck that, that's what we had before, that's what we have now. So for the purpose of this video um, I wasn't, I was just kind of messing around with it with the colors but I actually did um, a color correction before this video and I thought that it looked pretty good so I'm just gonna add that one on. So then we're gonna go back to the beginning of the clip and I'm gonna show you what the whole thing looks like. So this effect just kind of adds a little more uh, look to the f to the video. So as you can see here at the beginning when we uncheck this that's what we had before and this is what we have now. There's quite a difference. Greens are more dark. Uh, the blacks show through. It's it, it looks a lot better than it did before. You did uh, lose some color, and so the saturation is a little off here. 
on this uh, barn door right here as you can see uh, in the original you can kind of tell that it's a it's a cream color but in here uh, it's just kind of a little saturated out so you can go back and fix those kind of things if you don't think that they look good but for this purpose uh, I'm just gonna uh, play the video and let you see what it looks like So there you go. Um, it did add a little more uh, depth to it, a little more, um, just just lightened it up. So thanks for watching this tutorial. If you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comments below. And thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Bye.